This video is going to show the very basic use of AutoCRAT. So we have our data here and we have created our certificate. We did that in the previous video. So now we're going to come to Add-on, AutoCRAT, and click on Launch. In the bottom right hand corner we're going to click on New Job. We're just going to call this AutoCRAT Certificate. Click Next. Here's where you want to find your template. I like to copy the name of the template. Then when I come here and go to click from my drive, I can paste the name right at the top. This way we're 100% sure we have that exact template. Find it here and then click on select. It was fetching the merge tags that we created. So you can see it says currently selected template right here. Click on next. Here at the top you need to choose which sheet you are wanting to grab the data from. In this document at the bottom left if you look we only have one sheet tab but if you had multiple tabs this is where you would choose which one you want to pull the data from. If your column headers match your merge tags exactly it will map them for you. So we're going to scroll down here just to make sure that it did that. You'll notice here we have an error message because one of them did not match up. Maybe I had a space after the month by accident before I put my merge tags or in the column it is. So that's okay. We're going to click on this little drop down arrow and we choose which column we want to grab that information from. Now all of our tags are correct. We're going to click next. Here's where we're going to name our file. Now this is a very simple basic so I'm going to put all of these certificates in one file. So I'm just going to call it AutoCRAT Certificate. But in case I run this different days, I want to know which day I ran this one on. So I'm going to click here on this little arrow. And you'll see that I could add the merge tag names to this. And I'm going to show how to do that in another video that's a little adds more steps to AutoCRAT. But this one we're keeping simple. So we're going to use AutoCRAT's merge tag of today which will put in automatically the day that we run this um, AutoCRAT job. It'll put that date in the title. Our type, we are going to keep this as a Google slide, but if you click the drop down, we would have the option to get a final document that's a PDF. Here's where you have this last option of the multiple output or single output mode. Here's the difference between these. Multiple output mode is going to create a certificate file for each row that we have in our data here to the left. This is a great option if you are wanting to email files out to each individual person or maybe you're creating a folder where you want each individual student's um, certificate to be. We're going to print these certificates out so I want to use single output mode. Because if I was printing like a hundred certificates, I don't want to have to open up a hundred individual um, Google Slides in order to print those certificates. So I want it into one file altogether so I can just click the print button. So that is one option you do need to carefully choose based on what you're wanting to do with the files once you have completed. So now let's click next. I'm going to keep the folder where I've already been working. If you want to create a new folder, you would say choose folder and in your Google Drive, create a new folder for all these certificates or files to go. Click next. We are just doing a simple AutoCRAT job. So we're going to just click next through these different features, just accepting the default because we don't need to use any of these options. When we get to the very end, we're going to click save. So again, there's quite a bit you can do with those other options, but our first step is creating just a simple AutoCRAT job. Now it's time to run the job to create the certificates. So we click on the little play button here. Depending upon how many rows of data you have will determine how long it takes for this job to run. We only have three rows so this will be pretty quick. So once it's all done you'll see this screen back again. You can hit the X to close it out and you'll see these columns here with your data. Now you'll notice here, oops, our file name is all the same because we created one file. So let's go ahead and left click and open this file up. And we can see here is a certificate for each row that we have. It has personalized the certificates by putting each person's name, Becky Smith, 
here's Ashley Jackson, and there's Sherry's Whites. So that is how easy it is to create a bunch of certificates using Autocrat.